Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we will look at one of the common ways of reusing code that of creating a view. Views are nothing but saved SQL query. So they are like your virtual tables. And to reuse the same code better, you can create a view. So rather than writing a SQL query again and again, or rather I should say use SQL query again and again, you can create a view that encapsulates a logic and you can execute that view again and again to fetch the data that would have been fetched alternatively by the same logic. So basically views are used to encapsulate logic and you can use views to provide some level of security to the user as well. So we will look at creating a view in the demo. Creating a view is very easy. So you just need to go within that database where you need to create the view and the syntax is very similar to what you would do in SQL language. So just say create view and just attach the schema so that uh, this particular view is within the boundary of IND as just you are defining your SQL statement and note that a view is nothing but a saved SQL query. So every time you go and execute the view this underlying SQL query gets executed and returns the data. Note that I am making use of the table that I have created and I am not using any file from data lake store. So directly from the table I am querying it and I am creating a view. So let me name the job as view and submit the job. So the view is created successfully and if you go to the data lake catalog, if you go within the views folder, you will see the view that we had created and you can see the code that basically created the view. In the next video, we will basically go and query the view. Thank you.